Alrighty, welcome back. We're back at it again. This time I'm playing Trepang 2 Demo. Or Trepang Squared. I don't really know how to pronounce it. Um, this is the main hub for the game. You only unlock this after you've played it for the first time. Like the being the... After you've played the, the demo for the first time and beat it, right? Uh, so I actually already played this. And I did like, you know, a blind playthrough and recorded footage for it. I, I had like almost an hour worth of footage, but I had the game on pretty much like max settings or something along those lines here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I had it. I had it on uh, high uh, and my laptop can run that pretty fine. Like honestly, like really good. But to run it that high and record at the same time and like my recording settings are a little crazy so to be fair i could probably tone down my recording settings but i don't really want to do that because i want the highest quality video as possible so uh what i ended up doing was i, uh, I did some tests with recording and just to double check and see and i, I found out that having this on low settings uh makes for a much smoother recording experience so that's where I'm at with that. Um, it's a shame because I would have loved to have you guys hear my commentary as a first time playthrough kind of thing. Uh, let's pick up some Intel. Task Force 27, read in your database. Sure, eventually, probably not. So once you, once you beat the demo, you unlock this little hub. This is, I guess, how the game is gonna operate. You go over here to select your missions. Uh, if you go down in this direction, you can customize your look. I found the customization to be pretty um, To be pretty generic and like you don't even see your own character uh, Look, it's kind of just like basic and kind of ugly ish. So I didn't even bother with that. I'm not really gonna bother with this um, So that's where I'm at with that. There's another area where ah, there it is. There's a combat simulator and then I guess you can go through here and just do some cool stuff with that. I haven't checked that out re actually. Maybe I'll check it out a little later. Um, I want to get through the actual demo, the actual main mission story thing that you can play here. Because um, it's pretty neat. Um, uh, this game, uh, it's supposedly coming out this year. This is a free demo on Steam. As far as I'm aware, it's only for PC. Uh, the studio behind it, you know, everything from everything, all the aesthetic, the gameplay, the gunplay specifically. Uh, it looks like it's heavily inspired by fear. Um, some of the some of the videos stuff that I've seen for this game made it seem like there's also going to be some kind of horror elements too, which adds more, I think, to the whole fear vibe. If you're not familiar with fear, it was a 2005. Uh, first person shooter horror game and uh, in it you play as point man that's literally his name he's a silent protagonist and he goes through some crazy missions uh, uncovering some crazy secrets regarding a company and a creepy little girl with psychic abilities and who's haunting you basically and uh, the horror in that game was really done well it's a uh, heavily the horror in that game definitely inspired by like the ring and other Japanese horror type stuff uh, the the first person shooter aspects of that uh, definitely 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 inspired by um, by uh, all right we're gonna do the prologue see this is the launch mission type of thing uh, you were imprisoned at site 14 one of horizons top secret black sites they ran experiments on you and erased your memory you broke out and joined task force I was literally about to say task force X <laughs> what, what are we some kind of suicide squad or something Anyways, uh, so that uh, so fear uh, the first person shooter stuff definitely like kind of like uh, John Woo type of stuff. There's slow mo. There's all this crazy stuff, crazy weapons, a uh, lot of blood, a lot of gore, and even in the horror elements, a lot of blood, a lot of gore. Uh, it's not just a bunch of random jump scares. There's a lot of weird, freaky shit going on in that game. So a lot of this stuff with this game, Trepang 2 or Trepang Squared, I don't know how it's pronounced. Someone please tell me how it's pronounced in the comments or something. Uh, it's uh, it, it's uh, the gunplay for sure is definitely inspired by fear, uh, but they you know, made quality of life improvements to that formula. 
Uh, so it's a pretty cool time. Uh, I am a filthy console player, so I would prefer that this had controller support. Unfortunately, I have to use a keyboard and mouse, and some of you are like, well, you know, that's legit. And it is, you're right, keyboard and mouse is the way to go. Unfortunately, I am not good at keyboard and mouse. <laughs> I need practice. Um, let's launch this mission. We're gonna do it on normal, because uh, it can get a little tough for me, and the fact that I have to use mouse and keyboard, you know, it, this is, uh, this is, uh, this is St. Aldo Plays, man, you know? <clears throat> uh, I play games drunk, either, dr like, you know, I'll do a game trashed. No questions asked. I'll even play it on hard, trash. But give me a, but give me a controller to do it. <laughs> Don't give me a mouse and keyboard. Not that there's anything wrong with a mouse and keyboard. I'm just saying. There we go. So this is kind of how it goes. You know, there's the main hub. That's how you select your missions. You do some other stuff there, and you get in a helicopter, and it takes you to the mission start. <clears throat> so with this game. Uh, when you first try out this demo, though, you won't have access to the hub. It just kind of throws you right into the prologue of the game. Uh, and that's the first mission. Once you beat the prologue, then you get access to the hub. Um, this is, you know, the loading screen. I'm going to press continue now. And here we are. This is the start of the, of the experience. I actually really liked the music that was playing. It was a, definitely a vibe. Control Vault Security is not responding. We're moving to investigate. Bright Star. <clears throat> Control Vault Security is KIA. Subject 106 has escaped. Shadow Stealth. It's a vibe. Oh shit. If it looks like I know where to go, it's because I've already played this a couple times, unfortunately. Oh shit. Shit, shit, shit. Ouch. Ouchies, mommy. Don't hurt me.
Security station, do you have eyes on 106? <clears throat> That's a lot of blood. Security station, respond. What, what the fuck? All units be advised, security station is not responding. Cool beans. Got it done. Got a gun. We're gonna have to kill people, right? Let's kill some guys. In the video game, of course. Not in real life. Don't do that in real life. That's not cool. I'm so bad at the sliding in this game, though. It's like unreal how bad I am. What's over here? So this is where I'm supposed to go. Okay. What's over here? Oh, look, help. Ah, oh, wait, there's an, oh, interesting. Not as linear as I thought it was. What's in here? What's the point of this? What did I just get? More ammo? I don't know. The world may never know. I mean... <laughs> The, the way this is looking, too, you know, going crawling through the vents and all that stuff. Uh, the offices and crap and areas that you go through, at least in this prologue, is pretty much ripped straight out of fear. So, you know. God damn it. Alright, dual wield. Oops. And you can also turn invisible. Not bad, not bad. I will say this though. <laughs> this game gives me a little bit of motion sickness. So if you're getting motion sickness watching me play, you're not alone. I'm about to morb. I'm so sorry you had to hear me say that. Foxtrot. Yes. Shotgun. Give me the shotgun. This is where the fun begins. Yeah. 
blood. Blood. Everybody's blood. Oops. Okay, officially, I think I've gotten better at mouse and keyboard. At least I sure hope so. Ha <laughs> ha. I gotta save the shotgun for some truly egregious moments. Blood. Blood. Gallons of the stuff. This is where I came from. Yeah, see? No frame drops on this run, so far at least. From what I can tell from the from my OBS. Man, I've been sprinting though. Oh, that's blocked. Wow! Oh yeah, dual wheels. Hell yeah. Beautiful. Let's do this. <clears throat> no! Isn't that the guy that helped me escape? I think. At least that's what I think. It looks like he just killed himself, though. That's weird. I don't really know what the what the story is behind this. I guess as you play along the actual full game, you learn more. But uh, I'm not gonna learn it here in this demo. Sucks to be you. And you can even dual wield shotguns. Look at this. Already, this game is like amazing. It's like the best thing you could ever hope for in something like this. Hell yeah. Amazing. You know, the first time that I played this, it took me 50 years to get through this spot and even longer to figure out where I'm supposed to go next. Like, it was that bad. <laughs> at how bad I am at this game. And, you know, all games in general. 
You know, they might as well call me St. Aldo Bad at Video Games, please. Um, I forget which way this opens. But I think I'd rather have the shotgun. Gotcha now! Jesus, that could have gone a lot better though. <laughs> Definitely could have gotten a lot better for sure. Oh, here are the greens. There we go. I forgot where they were. <laughs> Why would you leave? I don't think I go through here, do I? Oh, I do. So then what was over here? Oh, yeah, yeah. This is... Oh, no, no. Wait. What? So then what is... What is over there? Is it just some random closet with supplies and ammo? Something like that? I guess so. survivors no no survivors good and I got more ammo for my shotguns you can also customize your weapons which is pretty cool I think uh, no laser let's do suppressors and cool and now let's put suppressors on these bad boys too. <laughs> I don't know what the difference is between folded and unfolded. I don't know how that works. I guess maybe in the year that it's a game. Die! Die! <laughs> Sorry. I got a little carried away there. <laughs> oh, Lada, not again. Whoops. I'm trying to reload here. Oh, shit. How did that not go off? I completely forgot there was bombs there. Look at this. Look at this. Let me move back some.
Oh yeah, oh yeah, all right. Yes, so this is the main part of the demo, well, the last part. But it's pretty cool how this is set up. Um, absolutely, yes, I need more ammo. So now where do I go? How do I? Attention, oh, cool. Units. We have confirmation at subject 106 is in the loading bay. Sierra 1, you need to move in now. Sierra 1? More like Sierra none in a couple seconds. How are you still alive? Cool. Sierra two, what the fuck is going on in there? Sierra three, engage. Watch my face, I'm Nope. You don't got me. <laughs> In case you couldn't tell, this is my favorite part of the demo. <laughs> Get the fuck in there now! grenade. Alright, so now this is where it actually gets a little bit tough. Wow, I suck. How are you not dead? It's because of this guy. He's in a... Look, see? He's in one of those blast suits. Hazmat suits. Whatever. Shit. Run.
Beautiful. Where is the helipad? I hope I extract safely! Oh. Which way do I go? Which way do I go? Here it is. Wow, I probably went in a complete circle around the thing. Oh, thank God, guys. You wouldn't believe the day I just had. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> I didn't know I could shoot him. I'm sorry, Alpha 3. Alpha 3 5. My bad, guys. <laughs> I did not know you could do that, by the way. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. So yeah, that's uh, that's the prologue of the game, I guess. Um, I wish the quality was better for the graphics, because I can actually play the game and run it smoothly um, on high settings, but for whatever reason, I can't run it on high and record at the same time. I guess it's a teeny bit too intense. You can wishlist the game on Steam. Supposedly it's coming out this year. We'll see what happens with that. There's a Discord. Um, Trepang Studios, Team 17. Uh, yeah. So now the game's loading, and it takes you back to the hub, which we were at earlier. It's a pleasure to finally meet you, Oh, well, this is actually the end of the, the demo thing. Corporation had you locked away for a and then you get to the, the hub. This is the it's main hub area. Now that you are free. You want vengeance. So do we. Vengeance. To task Force 27. <laughs> nah. Task Force X X V I I. It's a bad joke. It's a bad joke. Uh, hold off. Cool. What up, cuz? What's over here? Can't go. Oh yeah, it's locked. Can't go through there. Bum 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 bum. I got my guy running marathons. There's combat simulator, custom his appearance, mission select. Set. We have a mission ready for you. A raid on a Horizon facility, similar to the one you escaped from. When you're ready, head to the briefing room, and we can get started. Yeah. So then the other mission is this. It's a side mission, uh, complex in Stockholm, Sweden. Hopefully I don't develop Stockholm syndrome. Uh, again, you know, can change the difficulty each mission it looks like. And uh, yeah, you know, that's how you select the missions. And then you just gotta go to the helicopter. Bordering on seamless. I kinda wish it was a bit more seamless. Like, uh, you know, you get to the helicopter, and then instead of uh, going through another loading screen and then selecting the mission, it just kind of does this. And then, uh, all right, so sure, you can press continue, but then now it's like, oh, actually, oh, okay, never mind. It actually is like that. So this, uh, I tried a little bit of this before on my first run, first try. Oh, well, 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 how much do I have? $700? Black Ops kit. Cleanup? I don't know what this means. I definitely would like some armor. I don't know what cleanup is. Crap. So now the goal is to survive. Good 
Where did you come from? Wow, that was terrible of me. Wow, did you see how bad I was at that? Beautiful. DMRs. Hold still. Give me your shotgun. Oh, jeez. I didn't even know he was going to come through. I need health. Wow, okay. I'm surprised at how long I've lasted so far. <laughs> like, genuinely surprised. I'm gonna die. Don't mind if I do. Sheesh. I'm genuinely surprised I've lasted this long. I know I keep saying that, but it's like a wonder that I'm not dead yet. Sure, okay, it's normal mode, but like, I'm seriously hanging on a thread here. Oh, shit. No! 
I'm on a rampage. Can't quit now. Oh god, I'm probably gonna die here. Yep. <laughs> That's fine. That was enough of that. Oh man, that was cool. Um, yeah, so I think that's all I got with this. I uh, just wanted to show you guys this game, this cool game. Uh, let's go back to the safe house, please. Um, let me know in the comments what you think of the game. Uh, I hope it comes to consoles as well. If it, you know, I think the quality is there. Uh, I just kind of want to see more and make sure that like this is a this is the game that I think it will be. If it, if it's some kind of spiritual. Uh, maybe not successor, but spirit like in the spirit of fear where it's first person shooter horror You know that slow-mo stuff dual reading crazy action uh, I, I am definitely looking forward to this. So, you know uh, Shout out to the team team 17. I guess it is I think those are the developers for making this game and uh, Yeah, so let me know in the comments what you think of this game uh, let me know what you think in general of these uh, demo videos that I've been doing lately. I was actually surprised that I had the time to be able to record because I, you know, I, I, the major life event happened. I have a daughter now and I thought for sure like there would be no more content on YouTube. Lo and behold, luckily b between everything, I still had time, you know. Uh, I think it's mostly because I'm not working right now. I'm on, uh, you know, paternity leave. So... Uh, I think that uh, that adds on to being able to have the time. So we'll see how it goes in the future. Um, hopefully, I can just continue this uh, this traction that I'm going on and just uh, you know pump out all these cool videos these next few months. Uh, again, if I have the time. Uh, so yeah, like I keep saying, let me know in the comments what you think. Uh, you know, if you if you want to see this, want to see more kinds of videos, all that stuff, please, please, please like and subscribe. Tell your friends; it really helps me out. You know, let's try to get to let's try to get to a hundred subscribers. You know, that'd be great. <laughs> um, and then you know, from there, why stop there? The two hundred, five hundred, a thousand subscribers. Oh my God, that'd be great. I would love to be a part YouTube partner. Um, but anyways, uh. Trepang 2, Trepang squared, however you pronounce it, don't really know. I love y'all. Uh, I'll see you on the next one. Okay, I love you. Bye-bye. Oh, yeah, that's a good coffee. Okay, I love you. Bye-bye now. 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 Okay, I love you, bye-bye now, okay, I love you, bye-bye now.